If the ladies event isn't one of the most anticipated events on your WSOP calendar, it probably means that you're not here because the ladies event is one of the most fun, most exciting events of the series. And I have to tell you guys, the vibe in the room is always completely different. The vibes are so good. First of all, I got a gift at the table. It's just like lavender bag of smelly, yummy stuff. I would like to know if any other dudes have ever gotten a present at the table. I don't think so. It's just way more exciting. Everyone's like buzzing. Everyone's been looking forward to this event for a year. The girls are literally flying from all over the world just for this event and for the ladies week, which started on Monday. And this is kind of culmination of all of it. And it's just really exciting. The girls are lovely. Like one girl came to my table, offered coffee for everyone if anyone wants to order. Aww. And uh, not this year, but last year I had a girl coming and bringing you know, donuts for everyone. How cool is that? Well, I think a lot of women in poker look to this event as the highlight of their year. Uh, it's a big buy-in. I don't think there's any other big ladies buy-ins around the country at least. Uh, and for a lot of women, this is their largest event. This is kind of their main event. So that kind of creates a very you know, excited atmosphere and just very joyful and happy to be playing at the World Series of Poker. A lot of these women, this is their first time playing at the World Series of Poker and it's their biggest event, you know? So uh, I think that a lot of people are around the room are really happy. Melanie Wisner tweeted earlier and it was like the most amazing tweet because it was so true that like, this tournament is awesome. Everybody's moving fast. There's no tanking, there's no hoodies, there's no like over theatrics. Everybody's just like, let's get the work done and let's win the money, you know? So it's pretty cool. The ladies tournament is so fabulous. People are having a good time. They're supporting one another. If somebody loses, they say, oh, I mean, it's, it's genuinely a great time. I love this tournament. You know, it's um, it's actually, I'm going to uh, say something. It's the first time I've ever played a WSOP event. It really is. So I'm just like so, I guess, you know how it is. There's not much time and stuff like that. But this year I made a, you know, I made a concerted effort that if we're really going to move the needle to like more than 4%, I have to play in as many tournaments as I can. And so I've been really hammering it this uh, in 2019. And uh, yeah, just really pleased to be here and hope to play more um, tournaments in the future. There's a lot of people that are not comfortable with playing open events. And I think it's really good to have them come together and play amongst each other and just have like a really fun time. And then there's people who do play, you know, full time and play in open fields. They'll be like, hey, let's go play this tournament here, or that tournament here. So it's kind of a nice like segue into the main and the mini main and all that stuff so it's definitely my best uh, event to cover that's what i love the most uh, a lot of friends a lot of girls that i know uh, yeah it's one of the best events to cover like even better than the senior event it's a different energy everyone's relaxed well most people are relaxed we had a bit of an edgy old lady at our table but she's gone you know you got to bring in the good energy to get the good energy because if you come in like this you're going to go out like this yeah, it's cool. Why not bring the women together and have some fun at the poker table? I'm for it.